Hey everyone, this is Stalini, so I'm going to get right into your reading. This is going to be a general reading for whoever needs to hear this message. So let's see. Happy spring, by the way. So this is a love message for the collective. What does the collective need to know right now? If you want a personal, my information's below. Follow me on TikTok for more reads. So what is in the person's mind that you're thinking about right now? Hmm. So I feel like a lot of them are spying on you, thinking about what they have to do because they're gonna send a message they're gonna send some type of offer to you now with the page of pentacles it's not like a big offer this could be just like a hey hello how are you they're definitely spying on you a lot so what is the person feeling for you right now They're feeling like they really have to give you something major, um, a lot of pentacle energy. So they're also, I feel, very focused on money. And you could be dealing with an earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. They want to come forward to you. That's what their heart is saying to themselves. They want to make a move and they want to do it fast. They want to rush in quickly. What else are they feeling for you? They're feeling like they have competition. They feel like if they don't say something, they're going to lose you. Um, I feel like you already know this person. Like, a lot of people are like, oh, past energy. But this is just the energy that keeps coming out in the collective. So this could be a new person spying on you. But I just feel like there's a lot of, um, like history here because they're obsessively trying to figure out what you're doing what is this person in the near future action they're gonna rush in something quick is gonna happen there's gonna be a tower moment what else this has to do with a commitment so yeah that just confirms that i feel like you already know this person or you already like know of this person um but you do know this person in some way already uh, whether they are just a friend and they're gonna confess their feelings or if they're a co-worker or um some of you you just been knowing this person and now they're going to, like, actually come in with an offer before. I feel like they were, like, really hot and cold. Yeah. Bottom of the deck is the Six of Cups. So, regardless if this is, like, a new energy that you recently met or an old energy, the Empress wanted to be shown. You guys are in your Empress energy. You're not chasing, and this person knows it. This person knows that you're that Empress that they need to match the energy with. They know that they need to be that King of Pentacles. Right now, they're thinking about, like, okay, I really need to make effort. I really need to do something. Because right now, they're thinking, like, I can't really give this person much, but they don't want to wait because they feel like if they wait, they're going to miss out on this opportunity. So they're going to come in quickly and they're going to want this commitment with you and it's going to shock you. I feel like you're going to be shocked, to be honest. Six of Cups on the bottom of the deck. So a lot of you already know this person for a while. And um, some of you, something happened and they're coming back with the Six of Swords in reverse. They're coming back because they want that fulfilling relationship you're their joy you're their happiness you're what fulfills them with a ton of cups they want that marriage life they want to live with you they're like having a lot of emotion for you um six of cups they want to like have some type of reconciliation some type of reunion with you um 
Yeah, so some of you, you're going to be shocked because I feel like you felt like maybe this person didn't like you or maybe this person, like, you're going to be like, wow, this person has feelings, but you're really going to be like in a wow state when they come and something quick is going to happen with this Nine of Swords energy. Now, this is a general reading, so all messages might not resonate. It's the you know, general collective of what's going on. Some people don't understand that. If you want a personal reading just for your energy, then hit me up and I don't mind doing that for you. If this reading is resonating in a lot of ways, then I'm happy. You know, you're guided to this channel. If it's not resonating at all, don't try to force it. It's just not your reading. Maybe the next one will be. All right, so let's get more into this energy. What is this Six of Cups about? More. This is um some type of change, you know, in your direction. So things are going to shift. There was some type of cycle going on, and that cycle is complete. You could be seeing 10, 10 a lot, or 10, you know... There's definitely completion and seasons have changed. And now it's spring. It's so funny because literally there has been a lot of changes going on with this connection. Um, there's going to be this new beginning. Look at sunflowers. So I feel like, you know, and then there's like a pentacle here. By the time summer comes, you two will be in a totally different place. Spring energy is finally like pushing something with this connection okay so what was the blockage before the blockage is secrets this person i feel just was withholding their feelings um they weren't telling you what they were going you know what they were going through they could have been healing from something and now they're coming in they just weren't taking action before Okay, so what do they want with you? Some of you, they want to plant a seed. They want to get you pregnant. Um, they want to manifest. They want this relationship to grow. They're like going crazy out their minds. They probably are not sleeping at all. They're probably in a depressed state. They're probably having insomnia. Um, this person is having nightmares. Nightmares including losing you, I feel. This person feels like if they wait, they're not going to have you anymore because you definitely, you know, they know they have competition. With the Chariot card and the Nine of Swords and the Tower, I mean, expect serious change, okay? This energy, I'm getting, like, fast, soon energy. Like, some of you, within a week, even within two days from watching this video, whenever you watch this video, because my readings are timeless, you could be hearing from this person. Like, that is how quick that energy is. And like I said, first they're going to, like, fill you out, you know, say something, offer you a little something. And then they're going to, like, really come forward with those offers, okay? So, tell me more about this tower, yeah, this tower is about this emperor energy coming forward. They're taking charge. And because they're going to take charge um, in this connection, and they're taking charge of their life, you're going to be like, wow, I am getting like an older energy. So this person probably is older than you. It doesn't have to be that much older, but um, I'm definitely getting this person. I'm feeling like they're older than you for sure. Um, or they just have like a mature energy. Okay, because age, you know, numbers don't exist in the spiritual world. But their energy is definitely, like, mature compared to yours, like, um, in wisdom, years. Like, I'm getting, they have more experience than you. Maybe have more relationships. Maybe lived longer, you know, on this earthly plane. Knight of Swords again. So, yeah, definitely. Knight of Swords coming out twice. Like, yeah. This person's definitely going to take some bold movements. Um, 
this relationship is unbalanced and they're coming to balance things out karma was served i feel for them and so they want to give justice to this relationship they're coming with some sincere offer with the knight of cups they're coming to like propose to you there's going to be a major change. What is this stuff about? So perhaps there was some type of competition or third party energy or a conflict within themselves. They're ending that right now, okay? And um, they're going to like take charge and come forward to you. They're ending whatever was conflicting with them and not like coming forward to you. You're going to be really happy. The sun card is the best card. The overall outcome, you're going to be completely happy. There's going to be a completely new beginning. This King of Swords energy is not playing. They will cut someone, not literally, hopefully, but they will, like, do whatever needs to be done to get rid of anyone coming in between uh, you and them. Something shifted here, okay? As this is a general reading, I'm not going to get too into it. But something definitely shifted. Some major change happened. Okay. And now we're in a new season. And yeah. So what does this person want to say to you? If they could say something to you. What does this person want to say to you? I wish I could share my good news with you. This person really misses you every time something happens. They miss your conversations. That's why I feel like that has to do with what I said. Like, I feel like you already know this person in some way. It's time for me to heal now. So, yeah, they were probably healing from something, like I said. They were probably healing maybe from another relationship or needed to heal. They were going through whatever in their life, you know, and they couldn't, like, have a relationship with you because your life was chaotic so you know that's why they weren't doing anything so they can't resist you they cannot they're gonna go crazy um <laughs> sometimes i stay awake thinking about you so that is the energy that i was picking up on with how they like have sleepless nights all right so i hope you enjoyed this reading and like this video for me and watch my tiktok bye